were actually in the news recently about some golfers who weren't restraining themselves um, using a potty mouth on the golf course. Um, if we can find, if you can find it on the internet somewhere, but the um, Harrington podcast from last week, Podrick talked about his perception of the kind of live golf players using some foul language on the golf course. Um, I've, I, I didn't expect to be on golf.com, if I'm completely honest with you, but we were there. There was, you know, they linked to us as well, which was excellent. Mm. How do you feel about um, swearing on the golf course, Pete? Because we have seen in recent <laughs> weeks, we've seen you play in yeah. a qualifier that, that, you know, at the queue where Jacob cut out 85% of your swearing and there was 15% in and everyone was like, oh my God, Peter Finch is swearing on his channel. Um, how do you feel about it? So to put this in context, I mean, it did actually go a lot. So you, you said golf. I saw it in the mirror, yes. oddly enough, like yeah. UK newspaper. And then it was on Twitter. It was, it was, it was quite a few places yeah. about Padre basically saying that it's just maybe gone a little bit too far as far as some of the outbursts on the golf course. I don't personally think, and obviously Kieran, you were there as well. It didn't feel like he was saying that you shouldn't swear on a golf course. No, yeah, no, I didn't get It was that. almost like in some respects it's gone a little bit too far. Yeah. And like the Masters was the example where he was talking about a few of the live guys who were like very much bursting out yeah. with these expletives. Mm. At Augusta? At Augusta, yes. Wow. The Green Jacket Brigade was not in yeah. yeah, Yeah. I personally, it doesn't, bother me that much i think in some contexts it can be funny and golf as we all know is an exceptionally frustrating sport and i swear on the golf course sometimes just to relieve a little bit of attention sometimes it's just exasperation sometimes it's self-loathing sometimes i just fancy having a little bit of a swear mm -hmm. <laughs> the difference is i tend to have a microphone here so correct it can be picked up quite a lot now, with the guys on live, they don't wear microphones on, on live on the tour. They don't wear microphones, but there's boom mics all around. Mm -hmm. So if they do sway, they've got to be quite loud about it. And I think that's what Harrington was picking up on. And sometimes it feels maybe a few players do go out of their way to go over the top. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So that's maybe where I kind of net out on it. Personally, it doesn't bother me too much. But I can imagine some people being a little bit offended by it if you're watching it with your kids, say, as well. Yeah. yeah, Like, that might not be ideal. But for me, I'm pretty relaxed about it as long as people don't take the mick with it. <laughs> <laughs> I think uh, what, like, Podrick said as well is that he was sort of saying that he doesn't mind about it. And he doesn't mind, you know, if someone's thrown a club. And he even said, like, I'll even laugh if someone breaks a club. At, you know, what he, all he cares about is that it's not distracting him. Mm. And it's not impeding him or impacting him in a way that yeah. you know it, he's now put off for the next shot because he's just chucked his club and it's gone near him or something like this or he sweared loudly you know all these sorts of things that if it's done within themselves like he doesn't have a problem with it that's what i got mm. from it yeah um it shouldn't so. you, you shouldn't be so much that you put off the people around you basically. yeah exactly yeah you know if, you, if you're whacking your back i mean I, I remember playing some junior tournament tournaments and like other kids were like just whacking the back and they're like mm. I'm trying to trying, you know. to trying to visualize my yeah, shot yeah, shape here yeah. son. so you know and you know it's in the back of your mind a little mm. bit so you know as long as like if you know if it's happening sort of within yourself and you're kind of keeping it controllable which and you you know you do sometimes swear on the golf course but I don't think you you're not being like loud mouth and you're you know hearing about you're kind of keeping it under your breath a little bit yeah yeah there's only there's only a few times in my life where i've actually kind of had any outward which could be a distracting behavior to other players like if i'm going to be angry i'm angry at myself i'm not going to yeah. do it elsewhere but there was a, a playing a jamaica tour event like literally on a first term pro and one of the lads i was playing with a decent player and he got to a hole where he just hit an iron off a tee and he hit it into some thick rough now this lad had been a bit, he'd been a bit sweary during the round. He could tell I wasn't really that on board with him, to be honest. But he did this iron, and then he just set, he set his trolley out in front of him, like a, a walking pace, like in a, it was an electric trolley. Set it out in front of him. And he had his iron in his hand that he just hit the tee shot with. <laughs> Literally, until he reached his ball, he was hitting his bag. Yeah, and like that's... swearing alternately with every single swipe. Bloody hell. And at, yeah. at that point, I was like, that's 
he just looks like an idiot here. Yeah. Like he just yeah. looks like an utter moron. And like you said, he's then putting other players off. And he was playing badly from that point. So his behavior got kind of worse and worse, swearing, yes, like I said, to yourself, fine, whatever. But it was just so outrageous that he was mm. he was behaving like such a petulant child. Yeah. It was putting other people off. Yeah, well, that's to be fair, Tyrrell is on the live tour now, so. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but, I mean, because that's the only time. It wasn't him. <laughs> no, it wasn't, it wasn't Tyrrell. That's the only time I've actually put a complaint in about someone. Oh, you actually, oh, oh, wow. Because wow. okay. he got... He got to the end and one, the other lad who we were playing with, he had, a, he had a bad shot on the last and like he wasn't very happy and like we all shook hands at the end and this guy was a bit sad. And like the other lad turned around to me, the one who'd been hitting his back, he said, oh, he was a bit, he was a bit miserable, wasn't he? <laughs> <laughs> and I was like, mate, yeah, that's that. That's not it. Yeah, and yeah. I went in and complained. I said, "I'm not. Yeah. I never put me out with I don't. I don't think that's a golf problem. Though. I think that's like an actual mental problem. That's a him. Bro. That's a him. Going, that's, yeah. that's, yeah. that's nothing to do with his golf. He probably had something going on. You yeah. know, he had grits that morning. He <laughs> <laughs> literally grit. You know, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah that, that's not. That's. It just puts you on. It just puts you on edge. Like you know, if you know, if someone was like that, you're like, what's he going to do next? You mm. know, that's kind of what I'd be thinking. Yeah. One more bad shot. Is he going to come at me now? You know what yeah. I mean? Like, no, nah, I'm just, I'm joking. <laughs> <laughs> you know, you know what I mean? so, 18th fairway. Yeah, yeah. You yeah. watch that. It's, it's all context, isn't it? Yeah. Because like, yeah. every situation is going to be slightly different. I remember one of the captain's days down at the Shropshire. Like, we had a buggy out and there was a member there who was a big lad. And he was at one point riding naked on top of the buggy, kind of led down. Okay. <laughs> Now, you may be thinking that is disgraceful behavior, but in the context of that day, the amount of, oh, si yeah, yeah, the yeah. Amount of cider that was flowing on that golf course, mm. that wasn't even the worst thing I saw. <laughs> Lord. So it was kind of like, that's in that moment, it was stupid, it was unnecessary, but it was quite funny. Now, obviously, if you did that at the Masters... <laughs> That's not a great look. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Mm. So it's all about context. Like you say, like bad behavior, bad etiquette. That's kind of universal. Like that, that, that's never going to be acceptable really in any situation. But there are some points where swearing and just letting your kind of hair down a little bit, it's fine. Like, yeah. It mm. depends on who's watching. It depends on the context. Yeah. Would, yeah. would you do it in front of your, like I always think this about footballers who dive. You're like, your, your grand's watching you roll around on the floor. And like pretend to be injured when you're clearly not. Your grand's watching you spit on another player or swear at the ref or something. Like have some self respect for God's sake. No, I mean that's 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 a whole different story. Yeah. Mm. That that oh go oh, yeah let's get into diving. Let's, yeah. Yeah. let's do it. <laughs> Retrospective fines and yeah. bans. That's what I say. No wonder Ipswich got to the Premier League. Yeah. Bunch of cheats. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> I think anyone who anyone who's like touched like you see it all the time in slow motions like yeah. someone puts a hand across and like. I palm like palm Kieran off. He goes out like gripping his face <laughs> when I like touched him there. But that automatic three game ban, two hundred grand fine. It's, it's, yeah. it's this bit when it's like like that. Like yeah, <laughs> I like it when they're like yeah. Am I bleeding? Like uh, you know you hit you, you landed on the grass, <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Mr. Suarez, and he hit you in the chin. Yeah, you know, like looking at your eyes. Like oh. yeah, I'm bleeding at the back of the head. It's yeah. funny. Honestly, empower the referees. That's what I say. Yeah, yeah. Send them all off. Send them off. Oh, get them off. Yeah. <laughs> it will soon I've, stop. I've had enough. You're all going home. Yeah. Well, Taking me ball. I'm going home. <laughs>